Army Private E-2 Michael Allen Burgoyne, a 20-year-old soldier hailing from DeWitt, Michigan, has been in the Army eight months now, five of which have been spent working in the Joint Security Area, Pamun John. Yesterday, Private Burgoyne was awarded the Distinguished Purple Heart, presented by General William J. Livesey, Commander United Nations Command and United States Forces Korea. Private Burgoyne is the first to receive the Purple Heart for actions in the Joint Security Area, and after the ceremony, he related the incident to reporters. Though surprised, he said they were prepared. As I can say, as I feel that we reacted very good up there, the, the men of my platoon, they were very quick in their actions, I feel. Private Burgoyne took a rifle slug in the jaw on the left side of his face that passed through the other side, taking a bone chip with it. What's it like to get hit in the face by gunfire? I didn't think I got shot because it just felt like someone punched me in the jaw. And I fell back against the tree and I looked at the sergeant, Sergeant, sergeant Kim was standing there um, behind the van. I asked him, is it bleeding? And he was just looking at me in a real shocked manner. And I, when I touched it, I found out it was bleeding. So then I decided back to checkpoint four. After the presentation of the Purple Heart, General Livesey said the courage of Private Burgoyne and all American soldiers is amazing. You fellas never cease to amaze me. Your valor and your courage always cause me the deepest kind of respect and admiration for the American soldiers. One more time, you prove one more time just what the American soldiers can do. Private Burgoyne will spend about another week in the hospital recovering from his wound. After that, his plans are unknown. His first priority, though, after receiving his Purple Heart, was another call home to mom in Michigan to let her know her son Michael is okay. Air Force Sergeant Ron Tull, AFKN News, Seoul.